Hello children, welcome to our radio learning program produced by Rwanda Education Board with support from UNICEF. Children, do you remember my name? I am teacher Sarah. Remember, for the next weeks, we are going to be learning through the radio. And that is why I encourage you to tell your brothers and sisters, friends, to always join us. Parents or guardians, thank you for the support you gave us in the last lesson. And even today, please support our children. Wonderful children, hello. I hope you are still listening. Are you? Well, remember, every time you come for these lessons, bring a notebook and a pen to do all your exercises, take notes, and even homework. I am giving you 30 seconds to get them. Good. Parents, guardians, and my dear children, I have a very important message for you. Bruce Melody. Yeah, yeah, Murahone is a Mahora Mahoro. The Bruce Melody, you can name as a Hanima, you must have to go to the Zebucha. Never whatever you know, who fit me in the subject where coronavirus. Changwa se ukabuziko haruuzi afiti jamii mnyeto ukiri yako mnyesha imze gozu gozi mazikwe jereje changu gha magara kuri ni mero dimge dimge kane kujirango mhabge ubutawas ubutumwa bora bareba mugume murugo ngobi nchi amagara la sese kana yoyo yuhu Welcome back. Did you like the message? Now, let us continue with a warm-up song. May we all stand up? Good. You will repeat after me. Understood? If you are happy and you know, clap your hands. If you are happy and you know, clap your hands. If you are happy and you know, and you really want to show, if you are happy and you know, clap your hands. Good. Can we repeat the song together? If you are happy and you know, clap your hands. If you are happy and you know, clap your hands. If you are happy and you know, and you really want to show, if you are happy and you know, clap your hands. Good. Now, sit down and be good children as you listen to me. Who can remember what we learned in our last lesson? Wow, you are good children. We learned about sound blocks. Do you remember what sound blocks are? Good. We said sound blocks are the basis of all the words we speak. Sound blocks are the basis of all the words we speak. What else did we learn in our last lesson? We also linked each sound block to the written letters of those sounds. I repeat. We also linked each sound block to the written letters of those sounds. Again, we listen to different sound blocks of different words. One of the words we learned was book. Can we say book? Book has three sound blocks. The sounds are b, u, k, book. 
What else do you remember about our lesson, children? Wow, beautiful children. We had a sound song for each of the words that we learned. Is that clear, children? Well, today you will continue to improve your ability to hear sound blocks. I repeat, today you will improve your ability to hear sound blocks. Thank you for paying attention. But now I want you and other people around to listen to this message. Muraoneza nitwa Mani Marta. Muri iki gihe dukumira icyorezo cy'a coronavirus, abantu benshi bazi ko ahara ari gihe cyo kugira ubwoba. Nibyo ushobora gutekereza ko bihangayikishije, ariko intwaro ya mbere idufasha kwirinda so kugira ubwoba ahubwo no kubahiriza amabwiriza yose turi gusaba kuguma mu rugo mwibuke ko ari ryo banga rya mbere si gihe cyo kugira ubwoba ngo wumve ko niba ukoroye niba witamuye ibintu bicitse nura mu kugize kimwe muri byo bimenyetso kugira umuriro mwinshi guhumeka nabi gukorora cyangwa kwitsamura wikumvugiza ubwoba ngo wiyukanke ako kanya umve ko ngomba guhita ujya kwa muganga ako kanya aho ugahamagara rimwe rimwe kane ukabona ubutabazi rimwe rimwe kane Welcome back Did you like the message Can you turn to the person around you and share what you had in the message? Good. Now we are going to continue with our lesson. And we are going to play a game. Do you remember the game we played in our last lesson? Good. This time round, we are going to play a game with words that have more sound blocks. This time round, we are going to play a game with words that have more sound blocks. Remember, sound blocks are sounds that make up a word, and some sound blocks are written with more than one letter. Is that right, children? Let me repeat. Sound blocks are sounds that make up a word. And some sound blocks are written with more than one letter. How did we call sound blocks written with more than one letter? Wow! We call sound blocks written with more than one letter blended sounds. We call Sound blocks written with more than one letter, blended sounds. Do you know of any blended sound, children? Perfect. An example is sound ng. Mm. I repeat, sound ng. Mm. This sound is written using two letters. Letter N and G. Now, let us play our game. But first, let me repeat the instructions. I am going to say a word and you will tell me what its sound blocks are. I repeat, I am going to read a word and you will tell me what its sound blocks are. Then, we will link the sound blocks to the letters used to write that word. Is that clear, children? Our first word is forest. Can we all say forest? Good. Do you know a forest? A forest is where there are many 
trees and sometimes wild animals live in the forest. Now, how many sound blocks make up the word forest children? Can you count as I read the sounds? The sounds that make up the word forest are f, o, r, e, s, t. I repeat f, o, r, e, s, t. How many sounds did you find? Excellent. There are six sound blocks in the word forest. Now, can you tell me how many letters make up the word forest? Great! The word forest has F for F O for O R for R E for E S for S, T for T, and the word is forest. Wonderful children. Now, I want you to write a sentence using the word forest. Are we together? Write one sentence using the word Forest. Oh, I know you want me to give you an example. Let me give you an example. Wild animals live in a forest. Wild animals live in a forest. Children, it is your turn to write your sentence. I'm giving you 30 seconds. Parents, can you help me to check what they are doing? Perfect. Children and other listeners, I have another message for you. Please listen. Hello, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to go over, you know? I'm going to go over, you know? I'm going to go over, you know? Hey, Corona, you know? Hey, Corona, you know? You know, I'm going to go over, you know? 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 I'm going to go over, Ya ministeri y'ubuzima ibindi byose no byiteho yego ushobora kuyibona wayivanye kuri social media zabo ukayohereza kuri WhatsApp mu muryango ari kuje banze bebe ibyo wohereza biravaye eh biragaragaza ko bivuye muri ministeri y'ubuzima naho ubundi abantu anga barohereza IC utariyane ngo bimeze gutya ibiki ah ah wowe banze umenye hano mu Rwanda bimeze gute urabigirwa na ministeri y'ubuzima niba ari kuguma mu rugo barakubwira igihe tuguma yo igihe tugira yo guhaha ibyo byose biratangazwa na ministeri y'ubuzima ariko ubundi don't worry sigare mu mahoro tugume mu rugo tumere neza ya ubuzima ntabwo buhagarara enjoy ariko home welcome back I hope you liked the message and you wrote down the sentence. Our next word is desert. Children, say desert. Let me tell you what a desert is. A desert is a place with a lot of sand and rocks with very little rainfall and a few or no plants growing. Do we have a desert in our country? No, we don't. Now, children, I want you to help me identify how many sound blocks are in the word desert. The sounds are D. E, S, E, R, T. 
I repeat, the sounds are d, e, s, e, r, t, desert. How many sound blocks did you find, children? Very good. There are six sound blocks in the word desert. Children, what do you think is our next activity? Wonderful. We are going to tell how many letters make up the word desert. The letters are D for D. E for E. S for S. E for E. R for R. -r. T for T. Let me repeat. D for D. E for E. S for S. E for E. R for R. T for T. And the word is desert. Well done, my dear friends. It is time to write a sentence using our word desert. Before that, let me give an example. He knows how to find water in a desert. Let me repeat the example. He knows how to find water in a desert. Can you now write your own? Good. My dear friends, how many words have we learned so far? Wonderful. We have learned two words. Can you tell the words? Wow. The words are forest and desert. Very good, children. Now, the most important thing to remember is that sound blocks are sounds that make up a word. And some words are written using more sound blocks. Just like the words we have learned today. Before we conclude our lesson, please Write these words down in your notebook. Elephant. I repeat, elephant. Another one, daughter. I repeat, daughter. You will practice to write the sound blocks of these words as your homework. Is that clear, children? You will practice to write the sound blocks of these words as your homework. Parents, please make sure our children do their homework well. Children, that's it for today. Our dear parents, thank you for your support. I hope you enjoyed this lesson and will join me together with the children in the next one. Bye-bye!